Tonight, 8 News is digging deeper into a controversial situation at Highland Springs High School. A family is demanding answers after they say their son was detained for selling candy in the hallway. Now, we do want to warn you, we're about to show you a video that some may find difficult to watch. You can see the student here being held by his upper arm by a Highland Springs SRO. He tries to get free, but is grabbed once again. There are two others in front of him, and we'll hear what they said to him in just a bit. <coughs> For that, we head to 8 News reporter Autumn Childress, who was live in Richmond tonight after speaking with this family. Autumn, what did they tell you? Well, yeah, this family certainly outraged by this. Again, as you just said, their son, a student at Highland Springs High School, was manhandled by a school resource officer simply for selling candy. We're about to show you that video, but again, it could be hard to watch. Thank you. You're going to hurt Can yourself, you get buddy? off of me. Video tonight showing tense moments inside Highland Springs High School on August 28th. Get off of me. Stop. You're going to end up getting hurt. The student in the video, sophomore Ezekiel Richards. His family tells me he was selling candy when an SRO approached him. And this is what followed. Getting hurt. We obtained another angle showing that SRO on top of the sophomore as he yells for help. I'm more scared than anything. Richard's dad, Chris, outraged, saying he got a call from the school and could hear his son in the background. I hear my son screaming, Dad, Dad, they, they hurting me, they hurting me. The school saying Ezekiel was not complying with authorities, which is what led to the handcuffs. When Richards asked if that force was necessary, he says this was the officer's response. They told me yes. Now on Tuesday, Henrico police released a statement responding to what they called misinformation. A spokesperson said the sophomore was confrontational with an administrator. They said the situation escalated and that's when the SRO detained him. However, this dad maintains that selling candy at school is not a crime. I, I felt scared for my son. Tonight, Henrico police say an internal investigation is now underway. In the meantime, though, this family is calling for justice. You can't do that to kids. And to the officer that said he liked to do that to kids, I just want him to have an understanding. You can't do that to kids. That is not the proper thing to do. Now, Henrico police say they can't comment any further on the situation due to student code, but of course, we'll keep you updated. Live in Richmond tonight, Autumn Childress, 8 News.